Good morning, afternoon, and or evening, fellow gamers. Today, I'll continue the Tire 101 Nuzlocke, but before we get into the video, roll the intro. Yeah, so anyways, back to the video. This time, I made sure I am recording, because, yeah, last time, forgot to hit record, and that was a big oopsie on my side. But, yeah, it didn't really miss much. All, all I did was, I uh, get rat beard, uh, collect captain gun skull, etc, etc. Not much. Not much. It seems like I did a lot, but not really much. So, yeah, now we're going to Porter Mico to <clears throat> make peace or some sort of, I, I don't fully remember what it was from last time, but yeah. And yeah, I still haven't leveled up any of yeah. And I'm also planning on doing Lapbeard's, uh, what's it called, promotion quest today. Yeah, I'll do that too. So today's basically Porter Miko and also <clears throat> Lapbeard's cat. Yeah. Yeah, so hopefully this isn't too boring, but yeah, I'll likely, uh, Wait, never mind. Yep, sorry for background noises. That was just me that time, but there are always is going to be a background noise. And sorry about that. <clears throat> Anyways, yeah, back to Pirate 101. So, okay, well, yeah, I always just like those called uh, Rapier Promotion. Uh, look, it just looks very messy. I just don't like don't like the look of it. And also, his promotion from, oh, what's it called? <clears throat> uh, his second stage and his third stage are barely any a change. I mean, you can, you can see there's a change if you focus, but if you're just looking at it at first glance, you might think they're the exact same thing. Anyways, oh uh, yeah, let's talk to the Major Domo. The Governor's Palace. Yeah, okay, okay, yeah. So I forgot to say this last time because I completely forgot about this. You have business with His Excellency? I trust you have a letter of introduction. Ah, let me see. So, you are... Now we see if the credentials ever got us a good, yes? Ah, Madame Zardo of Darkmoor. I hope you had a good journey. I see the legends of your beauty are not exaggerated at all. <laughs> That's a fine likeness, that is. <laughs> it looks just like it. These credentials are fine, but I cannot, alas, let you see His Excellency the Governor. At least, not dressed as you are. See if you can find the shop of Bernardo Sastre, the tailor. He'll make sure your lack of fashion doesn't disgrace you when you see the Governor. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, and yeah, so let's do that. And this is likely going to be a boring ship battle mission. Because I remember it being that, so... I don't know if I'm gonna edit that out, because I'll likely make things... Why are you looming over my shop, gangly one? The Major Domo is quite right. You are dressed like a savage. I'm hesitant to even be seen talking to you, but I shall take pity on your plight. There's nothing to be ashamed of. It's hardly your fault you were raised without the tiniest shred of culture or civilization. To fabricate something acceptable in your size will be, uh, difficult. I must charge you 50,000 gold coins, labor included. Too expensive? There is an alternative. House Guzman has an unfair monopoly on Mushu silk. Bring me silk from their ships. I make your suit. Okay, okay, yeah. So we're gonna do that. Oh, oopsie boopsie, okay, yeah. So I believe we're gonna do that, but I don't know if we should do a rat beard's mission. You know what? Yeah, let's do rat beard's mission. My bobber thing first. Oh uh, yeah, I actually think I'll just plop on my first mate. Uh, keep you here. I need traps and boom. My new high-level team for now. Oh wait, uh, I was so okay. Gonna switch my world while going. I'm <clears throat> going to find a good friendship because I can't be found with anyone because I might have 
exactly. I classify that as cheating. Okay, uh, world. Uh, boom, right in us. Boom. Yay, next world done. Okay. Now, don't actually attack the ranches. Because I usually accidentally always do that. Anyways, yeah. So, time to do some philosophy with yours truly. Yeah, so. <clears throat> just going to be talking about a bit about philosophy because again uh, I really enjoy it oh wait I said that in the last episode except you weren't there to understand that but hear that but yeah I really enjoy philosophy and yeah uh, so I'm just going to be talking about it. yeah so <clears throat> uh, here's yeah I actually uh, began reading Hickam Kine and Ethics uh, recently actually yesterday I mentioned it in the episode before but again it got the lead up. <clears throat> um, sorry, uh, I actually, <clears throat> I forgot to report on that video, so yeah, that was bad, so, uh, yeah, the, so let's talk about it, uh, I only really understood the, a little bit of the beginning, since that's all I read, and I the summary of it, so I can learn even more about it, and see if I'm understanding it correctly, so yeah, basically, uh, everything has an Everything has, oh, is it called, a reason why you're doing it. And then, yeah, you learn about, what is it called, you learn, you learn about health to get better health, and you learn about strategy to get victory, you learn about how to make ships to get a ship, etc, etc. And I haven't read any farther, but I watched PewDiePie's video on philosophy, so yeah, he's, I believe, uh, I believe in the future it's also going to say, well, uh, why are you doing that? And then that's going to eventually be down to happiness, because everything's always down to happiness. Whether it be your happiness or someone else's, it, it's just there. Because every intent is for happiness. And that's some philosophy from yours truly. Yeah. Well, so far, yeah. uh, I don't <clears throat> Again, uh, yeah, I'm not the best at philosophy, but I've learned a lot from uh, many different people, so uh, I believe I'm really good at it, such as PewDiePie, my father, etc, etc, etc. Okay, now I'm going to place traps and destroy some fire. Okay, okay. Trap set. Trap set and snap. Okay. <coughs> Set. Okay, I wish I could do the snapping sound, but I don't want to be too loud today. So yeah. Something on me. Okay. Ooh. 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 Okay, fire to matches. Anyways, yeah, uh I saw on the Reddit, I don't know if it was fake or not, but uh, Mr. Beast talked about what was it called? Wizard 101, so I really wish he could talk about Pirate 101, because again, I really want the, the game to be revived, so that would be fantastic if he does that. But again, uh, the unexpected always happens, so he might, he might not, you never know. But yeah, big fan about it. But, but there is one thing I disagree with him. Uh, I, 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 I know he has good intent in doing it, but yeah, he is a good person, what he's doing is good, but I'm just thinking he possibly could do it better. Again, just like, uh, teach man, get, give a man fish, he eats for one day, teach a man a fish, he eats for the rest of his life. Yeah, uh, I, I was, believe, I was, uh, I believe a better way he can possibly do it is teach the person, but again, that's not the most, <clears throat> Uh, that's not the most, what is it called, entertaining way to do it. So yeah, I understand why he does it the way he does it, and I, under and I understand it has flaws, but I understand also that it's good in many ways. And again, everything has flaws. If it doesn't have flaws, it's not real, because everything has flaws. Everything has their Achilles heel. Big vocabulary, aka down uh, your yeah, Achilles heel is down next to your ball heel, uh, it's right above it. Uh, yeah, basically, if you can bleed to death, it will make you pass it, so yeah. Achilles heel represents a weakness. Everyone has their Achilles heel. Yeah. 
you. Victorious, we will be. Yeah, Justin, I enjoy using the word victorious. I, that's, I think that's just the thing with me. It just sounds satisfying. I don't know how to describe it. I just enjoy using the word victorious. I think it just makes me feel smart. I don't know. Okay, on to the next ship. Yeah, I hope you enjoy my philosophy speeches if you don't want to. To hear me ranting about philosophy, uh, you can just tell me in the comments, likely, but yeah. Oh yeah, I also completely forgot someone told me to go to the bazaar to buy more armor. Yeah, I, I completely forgot about that. So I'll likely be doing that too. Yeah, yeah, I will, I will. Uh, handle. Uh, yeah, okay, I got my schedule down and ready for today. Boom. One there, there, boom. You know what? Yeah, make a move awkwardly or get hit by a trap. Boom. Okay, crit. Is the tap a different is a type of ability, aka, um, yeah. what's it called? Uh, what's it called? Strength instead of the good old agility. But yeah, uh, yeah, did you know um, any, mission, any side quests that include wrath? A uh, capier actually uh, become in existence if a oh, wizard if he's gone in Westminster Skyway. It, it's obnoxious because I actually tried it in what is it called? Uh, uh, I did it on my Witch Doctor account because I decided, well, now I guess I want to use. Uh, why don't give I, I give Rapier to try? I, I probably can get uh, most of the best of the on him. Why don't I give him a try? So I did, and then I realized. Oopsie doopsie, uh, Catbeard's gone, so I'll have to do a whole 10 levels without him, which was, which is obnoxious, because I'm still doing it, but I can accomplish it. And I'm probably still not going to use him yet, but yeah. Keyword yet. Yet. I am on it. You go to one uh -huh. Boom. <laughs> Yeah. Oh wow. No, that oh wow. Okay, yeah, so I realized the viscous really under level. Yeah, I should love it. Yeah, I'm gonna level up uh and and the viscous depending on who I want to use. Oh jeez, I didn't realize how little health I had. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I know I'm forgetting about Chan Pao, but I'm not gonna- Oh, wow, that was a cool animation. Okay, now it's gone. Okay, Glut Treasure Chests quickly. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, where's the other thing I can say? Ah, uh, bah. Boom. I to go to the court. No. Once more. Yeah, so I really hope you're enjoying my commentary. Uh, yeah, and again, it's probably low quality because, uh, one, I'm a kid, two, I'm stupid, three, this is my first time doing it, which I say it over and over. Okay, yeah. Yes. Focus. Ah, here is the silk. No doubt my competitors will miss it dearly. <laughs> uh, I took the liberty of making this suit while you were gone. It will fit, don't worry. I delivered it to the governor's palace. The major domo has it. Okay, wait, do I level up because of this? Let me quickly see. Hmm, yep, I sure do. Yay, good. Okay, and head up there. Flip, 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 flip. Okay, yeah, I can't wait till I get up. Wait. You must be here for your suit. It certainly took you long enough. Here it is. <laughs> Oh, oh, you look marvelous. My cousin Sastre the tailor has done you proud. You're ready to see the governor now. You may proceed upstairs. Good luck and do try to behave yourself. I can dress you properly, but I fear I'll never make a monkeystan out of you. Okay, 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 let's head on. Yes. Well, Captain, you certainly look... Uh, well, you look... Uh, 
Ridiculous, Captain. You look ridiculous. Those monkeys are making a monkey out of you. Okay, okay, let's uh, level up the fist. Punch, because yeah, I'm gonna keep him on first spot. <clears throat> Greetings! You're very bold to come here wearing last year's fashion. You've come all the way from Skull Island? What are you, a pirate? A treaty? How fascinating. I shall give it all due interest and respect. Do you have a gift? I am honored. This chalice is uh, very fine, I'm sure. Ah, I see now. You are expecting to see Governor Ortega. Ah, I fear he was declared a traitor to the realm and sealed in a dark pit. So sorry. It has been pleasant speaking with you, but my duties demand my attention. I shall consider your treaty closely. The Major Domo will have my answer. Okay, okay, let's talk to the Major Domo then. Dupsy, dupsy. Oh, I guess when we have to sink. His Excellency is too polite to directly refuse, but I assure you, he will never sign your treaty. His answer is a no. Your gift was an embarrassment, to say the least. But there may be something else you can offer in return for signing your treaty. I know who you are. You are the pirate who robbed the Presidio, yes? There are some who could make good use of your boldness and cunning. Seek out Bishop Hidalgo in the cathedral. He may have an offer that will interest you. <laughs> but for pity's sake, don't go dressed like that! Okay, okay. Let's go over and talk to Bishop Hidalgo. Okay, okay. Let's head on over. Yeah, I don't know if I should skip through the text or not, but you'll see if they get a little boring. Oh, that's going to be off single again. I'm sorry. Greetings, child. I trust you are not here to pray. We have much to speak of. I know your errand, and I know that it is doomed if left to formal channels. But, on a more informal level, a task must be done, vital to the crown. The demands of honor make it impossible for any monquistador to do it. But you are no monquistador. Yay, Papucho! Papucho. The islands of this cluster are covered in ancient ruins whose mysterious builders vanished long ago. Nobody knows who they were or what they were doing, but they left a legacy inlaid in the living rock of their temples. Gold. The Monquista came to Skull Island before any of the other nations of the spiral. The gold we pry from these ruins makes us wealthy and powerful. Bold Monquistadors led the conquest of Skull Island, but one name outshines all the rest. Gortez. We owe him our wealth, our influence, our very empire. Almost a year ago, Gortez embarked on his latest adventure. I am asking you to follow him into the very heart of the Isle of Doom. Do not be afraid. The island is named after its discoverer, uh, Baron Ferdinand von Doom, who was unfortunately devoured by a giant snake. I hear the island is a very pleasant place, as long as you avoid the swarms of carnivorous bees, flesh-eating plants, and uh, savage frog tribes with poisonous skin. I have no doubt you'll do very well there. Gortez was drawn to the Isle of Doom by rumors of vast treasures on that shadowed island. At first, Gortez was triumphant, as always. He and his troops cut a swath into the jungle, crushing all who opposed them. Gold poured out of the jungle, more gold than ever before. But in the months that followed, disquieting rumors reached us here. Gortez, they said, had lost his way and was doing questionable things. Four months ago, all contact was lost with Gortez and his army. Their fate was not known until a Monquistador came staggering out of the deep jungle, raving with fever. He said Cortez had built a kingdom for himself in the jungle and ruled it like a tyrant. He had also found something wondrous, the gold monkey, a treasure beyond reckoning. You must act where our strongest cannot. Go to the Isle of Doom, 
Find Gortez and bring him and this gold monkey to the governor. Succeed, and I will ensure the governor signs your treaty. Go to Arroyo, the outfitter. He will prepare you for your journey. Okay, okay, let's do that. Uh, uh, where is all oh, this creepy looking in the box? Okay. okay. Sorry, I was talking to myself on the so, yeah. Anyways, let's talk to Outfitter here in uh, Kemper now today. I'm gonna bad at pronunciation while specifically pronunciating specific words. Well, never mind. Uh, yeah, specific words. So, you go to the Isle of Doom. I hear it's a lovely place. Provided you keep clear of the monster spiders. The skyways near the island have grown very dangerous. The scurvy dogs and the hungry fish make the place too difficult for most ships to approach. When you sail there, I ask you to take these food supplies to the gold miners. They've been cut off for weeks. You'll be a hero to them. Okay, okay. But we'll save that for next time. No, I'm not ending off this video here. I'm gonna go... Oh, I thought that was the first person. Oh, wait, no! Another person here. What? <laughs> Why? Why do you have to do this? And I'll just avoid them. Yeah, so right now, uh, I'm gonna be doing the thing the But before I do that, I just need to mark the description because you'll understand it. Wait, no, there's a cavern in the script shop. Never mind. Never mind, no need for that. I got everything from the gold. Hmm. Oh, alrighty. So, I, I really don't have any more topics to speak about, but... Uh, yeah, so if you want to hear me sp speak about specific, uh, specific things besides philosophy, because you're probably bored of it by now, if you want to hear me talk about anything else, you can just comment it, and I'll likely will. Maybe. I don't know. Oh yeah, I don't know. Okay. Back here. I was preparing to go after Gun's Gold. I needed to raise some money to recruit me lads and impress the Waponies. I sold me best blade and captain's finery to Bill Bobstay, a pawnbroker in Scrimshaw. Well, I reckon it's time we got him back. If we can find a way into Trade Wind Skyway, I ask for the chance to seek out old Bill and get my gear back. Let's see. Okay, okay, let's do this. Let's talk to Bill Bobstay. Who are you then? Ratbeard. Aye, oh, we've done our share of business. I took some of his things, yes. A blade and a right smart suit of clothes, as I recall. <laughs> Had to sell it all, I'm sorry to say. The clothes went to Twitchy Jake Creedy, an old friend of Captain Ratbeard's, as I recall. He is no such thing! That black-hearted skunk of a rat is no friend of mine! I'll take my things back by force, if need be. That's your business, not mine. I think Creedy and his crew have taken up in the dockside warehouse if you want your things back. Okay, okay, well, let's head there. <clears throat> Sorry, okay, yeah, let's head all over. <laughs> head on over to the complete big Creedy's dockside warehouse. Yeah, again, I don't know. Ah, Ratbeard, I thought he might come by. Who's this with you? Look out, Captain. You'll never be safe so long as Ratbeard is standing behind you. A fine coat I found, isn't it? I figure it pays back half of what you owe me. Oh, you mean to take it? Well, that's fine by me. Boys! Okay, let's find him. Yeah, so, uh, actually, I noticed that his blade's the same blade that uh, Ratbeard gets at his, uh, uh, what's it called? <clears throat> At his final promotion, so oh, that's a cool Easter egg they added in. Oh, yeah, let's close the trap there, flash there, wrap your approach, boom, boom, boom. Oh, almighty. Snap. Oh, now that's a lot of pain. Snap again, now that's a lot more a lot of pain. 
Okay, yeah, this battle's likely gonna be easy. Well, since I don't have anything more to talk about, more philosophy. Hopefully you're enjoying it so far, because that's what you're gonna get, because that's the only thing I really know about talking about. So I absolutely love it. Well, maybe I could- yeah, you know what? Yeah, I'll talk about the human body this time. Wait, wait. Before you say anything, you may have noticed. Yes, I am a nerd. Yep, so yeah, that's one bit. Yeah, that's a thing. I'm a nerd. You'll clearly understand it uh, by my rants and etc. Et et so yeah, let's talk about it. Specifically, uh, what's it called? One of the minerals, I believe, that people are... Uh, I may not remember it exactly because this is coming off the top of my head, but yeah. One of the minerals that people uh, don't get enough of. Uh, which is the second most uh, mineral that people don't get enough enough of, uh, and the first one is and the first <clears throat> the the most minerals people don't get enough of is fiber. I believe minerals is the correct term. I don't really remember, but yeah. And uh, the second and the second one, which is what, the one I'm going to be talking a lot about because I uh, I know a lot about it, is magnesium. Now, uh, this, this, <clears throat> this mineral has actually, uh, <clears throat> uh, you may be thinking you've never heard of this because, yeah, it, no one ever talks about it, but yeah, a uh, magnesium, one of the greatest things, it counters, <clears throat> uh, it's made as a counter, chem uh, counter chemical slash, uh, wait, you know what, wait, is it a chemical or mineral? <laughs> I'll just say mineral. Yeah, it's a mineral. It came, yeah, they're both. Uh, yeah, magnesium is a rock. Yeah, I'll talk about it a little later after, after I get the treasure. But yeah, uh, it's a mineral. Enough. Take your coat and hat, you old rat. Could hardly stand the smell of them anyway. Your sword? I know nothing of that. I only bought your kit from Bob's Day. Go ask him. Where okay, it is. okay. Now, uh, the second thing I was going to be talking about is uh. What it does now, it counters the thing. Uh, the uh, I don't know if this one's a mineral or chemical, but it counters this. Uh, what's it called? Uh, likely mineral. Oh, uh, wait, I'll say it later. The sword was purchased by one eyed Jack over in Flotsam, an old friend of yours, yes? We'll see about that. If Jack's up to something, there'll be the devil to pay. Okay, okay, let's head all over, head over there. Using our teleportation ability. Woo hoo. Okay. Anyways, yeah. Uh, so what I was. Oh yeah, I was saying that uh, about what cortisol does. Now, cortisol is the complete opposite of magnesium. It's specifically made for <clears throat> survival. Since one, it makes a loose fat less, which of uh, loose fat less and loose calories less, which of course is a good thing for survival. And it also uh, makes you more fear, uh, afraid of things, which again is a very negative thing because we don't need fear currently because, yeah, we're not in a survival state. And also, uh, yeah, it makes you more anxious, etc, etc, etc. So yeah, that's what magnesium uh, <clears throat> cortisol does. Now magnesium is the complete opposite. Uh, it, remo it removes stress. Uh, <clears throat> it removes stress, uh, makes you lose fat easier, makes you gain muscle easier, etc, etc, etc. Now you may be thinking, well isn't it illegal because of, because uh, if it has specific side effects? Well, actually no, it's a mineral. Uh, yeah, uh, it's natural. But <clears throat> and also, uh, the only negative side of it, uh, I think is, is <clears throat> that it makes you more wants to frick more. Anyways, before I more continue, uh, I'll, I'll talk. Hello again, young pirate. You and Ratbeard have sorted out your differences, I see. <laughs> Piracy makes strange bedfellows. If I'm right, Ratbeard has come looking for his blade. Well, don't get cross. I bought it to hold it safe for you. Least I could do for an old friend. Ratbeard, your sword is hidden in one of my rental properties, a cabin not far from here. Enjoy. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll claim my favor later. Okay, okay, let's head on over there. 
and say, oh yeah, I need to put some eggs on it. Yeah, I'll probably do that later. Yeah, so, uh, also, yeah, cordycell is much easier to gain than magnesium, because <clears throat> cordycell is found in things like vegetable oil, uh, specific yogurt preservatives, uh, things, <clears throat> uh, flax seeds, and there is also a, a fourth thing, which I don't remember, but, uh, all of the, wait, I'll say it later, because I'm gonna, they're soon gonna be talking, so yeah, I'm gonna say it later. Here's my blade at long last. Now, huh? You vile black-hearted traitor. Poisoned your own crew and thought nothing of it, did you? And you, pirate, we had a deal. You were supposed to catch Rampier to stop him, but you took him on your crew. How dare you? Poisoned? I never poisoned you. I just meant to put you to sleep, not, well, to put you to sleep. Okay, well then, uh, back to what I was talking about, yeah. So, magnesium is commonly found in dark green vegetables, which of course, uh, people greatly dislike. So yeah, a great alternative to it are uh, specific gummies of <clears throat> magnesium, which is a mineral. And also, yeah, uh, people, yeah, so it's very great. And no, you can't yeah. overdo it, or if you do that, basically it gets stored as fat, because if you have too much vitamins, minerals, etc, etc, it doesn't use it because there's already enough of it, which then it stores to fat, or it gets uh, automatically, uh, <clears throat> uh, ex <clears throat> it automatically comes out, uh, and becomes useless, so yeah, so... Uh, there's a limit, of course, and if you cross it, you just gain, uh, it just gets stored as fat, so, uh, yeah, that's not too big of a negative if you accidentally get one team. So, yeah, that's just, um, <clears throat> how science works, truly. Yeah, I enjoy human anatomy, anatomy, psychology, and philosophy, those are, uh, Three big things I really enjoy, cause uh, one, I, there are some things I need to improve on. Partially, and two, I just enjoy the, uh, I just enjoy the subject. Of it, that's all. Anyways, snipe shot. Oh wait, uh, yeah, I think it'll. Uh, that's not gonna. Be, oh wait, jeez. That will help. Well, you're gonna run away. You're gonna. Yeah, yeah, like that. Yeah, so uh, spirits with relentless and blade storm now, they're a threat because that's the thing that almost killed Louis Lebis when the thing wasn't recording, uh, when I wasn't recording, and he was at full health. So yeah, uh, these are very threatening. Because they got relentless blade storm and high will, which are, uh, yeah, which is very dangerous. Oh, it's time for incendiary shot. I think that's how you pronounce it. Oh wait, no, no, you, I don't want you to die, yes. sit still, clock, clock, yeah, okay, yeah, um, Lepisk's Overwatch will likely handle less, and so I believe, I don't, wait, no, it won't, yeah, rap specifically place for rap beard where it's impossible, oh wait, never mind, he was intending to attack someone else, oh, he should have done that, but now he's a goner. Okay. Oh. Uh, oh, I don't have that move on me right now. Oh well. Uh, you Stay still. Oh yeah, you only have flank. You don't have any repose or any of that stuff. Good. Well, victorious. We are. Okay. Let's collect the treasure. Okay. I thought getting me old kid and sword back would make me feel like a new rat. But after hearing what became of the old crew, I never have harmed a hair on those boys' heads. Oh, I trick them out of their share of the treasure, but that's just pirating. Let's get back to the tavern. I have some thinking. Okay, to do. okay, let's head to a tavern, aka Skull Island, because I need to do some more stuff there. And I also forgot, yeah, I forgot, 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 I forgot
first of all, before I do anything, I need to talk to my trainer so I can know what to call. Get another ability since I leveled up, and I believe I can get another ability. I don't know, guaranteed if I can, I, but I think I can. Quick shot. Ooh. Wait, when's the next time I'm gonna get my uh, Farther range. I seriously. Oh, so it's. Okay, so it's more of a gun thing. You get a specific weapon that gives you range. You don't. Specific, okay, yeah, now I understand. I understand. Because mm -hmm. Witch Doctor, for Witch Doctor, it's the opposite. Uh, it's not the staff. You have to learn uh, how to you get uh, <clears throat> a specific thing which allows you to use range moves out for the range. I forgot what it was called, but yeah, it, it, it's there, so. Oh yeah, and you also, uh, you, oh, I'll do all those stuff later. Oh yeah, first, the bizarre thing. I'm gonna go into the bizarre. Yeah, gonna quickly do some buying and selling. Okay. Yeah, hopefully this part isn't that boring, but it is gonna be boring, guaranteed. No, doubt. okay. Yep, okay. Hats, uh, what's my current equipped in here? Uh, I currently got- okay, my hat's good enough. Armor. Ooh, I need- I could get better armor. Okay, okay, ooh, that's good. Uh, uh, nope. Ooh, okay, this is fantastic. Yep, this is good, this is good. Can buy that. Block? Okay, okay. Uh, boots. Right. Never mind, my boots are good so far. Weapon, I got a good weapon. Hold on. Uh, I think I'm good with my current total. Char okay, I'm good with my charm. Okay, ring. I believe I can get a better ring. Ah, uh, ooh, yes. Ding, ding, ding. Got a better ring. Okay, got that. I'll, oh, I'll equip them later. Uh, yeah, let's go talk to Ratbeard now in the tavern. Oh, Jesus, this one has been long. Well, sorry about that. Well, hopefully you're actually enjoying this. Okay, let's head on down. Captain, I'm sure them drops I bought were knockout drops. Somebody else must have slipped me poison. I means to find out just who did it. And that day, there'll be a reckoning. Till then, I guess I'll try your brand of piratin'. I'm glad to be on your crew, Captain. You've shown me the error of me old ways. That's promotion time. <laughs> Woo hoo. We got him as well. Now let's head all up. Yeah, I'll be heading over to the gold mine, and oh, once I'm there, that will be where the episode ends for today. Yeah, sorry if it's a bit long, but again, it's gonna be long. Okay, well, let's give him a uh, uh, blade storm. Is that something here? I think I'm gonna also give him the power you know what, I am confused on rather if I should put Lebisk or, uh, you know what, no, Lebisk got the snap. I think that's good, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna need that more than Bonnie's epics right now, so yeah. Okay. Yeah, my little Braytail will soon be out the team. I don't see him as the best companion, but yeah, he's soon gonna be out because I only used him for his level. He can be a good companion, but again, uh... I know, I mostly use the first level. Rapier, he's likely going to be staying for a while because of his high level and his, uh, <clears throat> three epics. So, yeah, it'll likely be Bisk, Anne, and Beard for a while. Uh, I don't know about Anne Livingstone because her promotion is later, so I won't use her yet, but yeah. So that, yeah, that's my ideas on it so far. Anyways, yep, let's head on over there. Hopefully it'll be quick. Uh, let me just at look command. at some stuff. Yes, that might be. Dude, I never realized that you had to work. 
Okay. Anyway, so let's head on over there. Hopefully, oh, uh, gear. That's what I work. That's the other thing. Yep. Okay. Coke. Bah. Bah. Good. Okay. Okay. I should have changed the purple to a darker purple on my uh, tire, but eh. Okay. With our access guide. Oh yeah, organizing powers too. Snapshot. Plot. This is the worst. Oh, plot. Snapshot. We'll take that with quick shot. Plot. Boom. Yep. It's gonna be. Wait, which one deals more damage? This one deals more damage. Pop. Okay. Good. Got my setup done and ready. Now we'll just go to the Isle of Doom. And yeah, uh, <clears throat> give me a few seconds. Yeah, so I think that's going to be all for today, folks. So hopefully this video made you, the viewer, happy. And also, roll the outro.